I think he lives up in Seattle. Uh, and this is this is really philanthropy at its best. Um, he yeah, he he did this all you know out of the goodness of his heart um, and made it available for everyone. This is uh, like um, I don't know. It's it's just it's the closest thing you're gonna get to like an actual textbook, I think, um, without having to put down money. And I I'm hesitant to suggest this site as a as a as a way to learn Japanese, um, but it, it's absolutely great for uh, um, actually, like, if you learn something, to go back and look at examples and to, to solidify things you already know. Um, and so, um, yeah, this is really as close as you'll get to a textbook. Um, and so one of the best parts about it is that it's actually in 11 different languages now, and that's just thanks to his, uh, to his users um, who have volunteered their time to uh, change it into different languages. I'm not sure what languages they are. Um, off the top of my head, I think there's like German, um, Korean, there's other things as well. But there's a bunch of languages there. Um, so a whole bunch of other people around the world can use this uh, resource. And so uh, here's here's just a little, uh, the top of the page here of Tai Kim's Guide to Japanese. Um, and so, like, uh, here it starts an introduction, goes through the writing system, basic grammar, um, and it's it's really great. It's uh, it's very step by step. There's a lot of examples, um, and mostly I think it's it's about grammar. But uh, he also includes vocabulary words um, and even sometimes worksheets. So this is a worksheet here. Um, so it's absolutely wonderful uh, resource. And he also um, he also has a blog. I think it's. This website is guide to japanese.org slash uh, blog. That's, that's uh, Tai Kim's blog. And that's a blog I follow, and it's really good uh, if you're learning Japanese or Chinese too, which is another thing he, he focuses on. And he focuses on Korean a little bit as well. So, um, and then, like I said uh, before, I'll be giving you guys a, a PDF of all this stuff so you can, you can check out the links here at the end. Um, all right, and so my number one choice. Uh, is Lang 8. Um, and so Lang 8 is this, uh, this website where um, basically what it is, is there's users from all over the world. And, um, <laughs> and so like, what you do is you write journal entries basically um, in the language that you're learning. Uh, so like, for example, probably Japanese for you guys. Um, and then native speakers, so that's why I said there's users all around the world. Native speakers will actually correct these entries for you. Um, they have a great correction system. And then, um, theoretically, you do the same for them. So you reciprocate and uh, help them out as well. So um, I really like this site. And the reason I really like it for Japanese is that recently it became very, very um, popular in Japan. So it got on Hatena, which is like a Japanese bookmarking site, um, which means there's tons and tons of Japanese users on there right now. Um, <laughs> Tofu we did not make number one. Uh, sorry, Ron. Um, and so, um, the great thing about that is that there's lots of people eager to help you and eager for your help as well. So, I mean, the whole idea is just, you know, you got to help other people out and then um, they help you. They help you back. So, um, and it's really easy to make friends. Uh, people are very friendly. And that's one thing, another thing I like about it too is the community is very nice. Um, and so it always makes me want to come back. So let's see. We're going to look at a, a journal entry here, I think. Yes, so this is uh, it's kind of small. This is my journal entry right here. Um, and uh, so I wrote something in Japanese here. Uh, and then I, uh, then someone corrected it here. So this is my, my entry. And then someone down, oops, sorry. Let's go back. Someone down here, they, they corrected uh, a couple of lines from my from my uh, journal entry. So um, let's make it a little bit bigger. Hopefully it doesn't kill the system. And so um, you can see the first sentence here. This is what I wrote. Excuse me. And then this is what uh, looks like Kohei, so Kohei wrote uh, to correct my sentence. Um, this is what I wrote. And then this is what he wrote to correct my sentence. So he crossed it out. Um, you can make things red. You can make things you know, blue. You can hold them and cross them out. And then he wrote a little comment here. Um, so it's absolutely wonderful to have people to basically 
correct the things you write. Um, <laughs> if, you're doing, if you're in a class, Japanese class, pump your homework in here. Uh, get it corrected beforehand. Um, and so this is, uh, this is what, Hiro? This is Hiro's uh, journal entry. It's a Japanese person learning English. And so it looks like Hiro wrote, I like Bikram yoga. Temperature of room is biggest difference to another kind of yoga. We do yoga in 105 Fahrenheit. Bikram yoga has 26 kinds of poses and it goes on same order and same length every time. I feel it is ritualistic. And it goes on like that. So yes, it is <laughs> Hiro Nakamura, yeah. Uh, from here, that's good. <laughs> um, let's see, and then we have a question here, but how do you know who's who's correctly correcting? Do you have a list of good people? Um, you don't necessarily have a good list of good people. Uh, you just got to trust that they're correcting it correctly. Um, and I haven't had any problem with it. Uh, and if anything, I'm, I'm correcting people with my terrible English. So... Um, there's kind of a way to tell if it's a native speaker. You're supposed to put it in your profile, and then Langate actually matches you up with people who are uh, matches with you. So if you're learning Japanese and you speak English, they'll match you up with someone learning English who speaks Japanese. Um, so the, it's not a perfect system, but uh, you guys you just gotta to trust them, I guess. Um, so here's here's this person's journal entry. So I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna correct it. So at the the bottom of the entry, it shows everything sentence by sentence. Um, and let's see a question from May. How long do you have to wait until someone's correcting your work? Um, yeah, like uh, Tyler said, it's not very long. I've I, I added a ton of people as friends, so it usually gets done in about an hour or two. Um, so yeah, and it worked within 24 hours. But people are really great. Um, and so so here it goes line by line here on the the corrections. And so I just click on one of these. So I think I clicked on uh, the second one. I want to say. Yeah, and then this little box comes up, and um, here's the sentence, and so I can choose red, blue, bold, cross out, um, to, to mark certain things, or to cross out certain things, so this all shows up here, and then it shows up the, the final version down here, um, so I, I changed it, and uh, hopefully it's correct, but I think DJ is better at English than I am, so maybe <laughs> we should move on to the next slide, if anyone cares. Notices. So there it is, uh, all fixed, and then that person's going to see this um, as uh, as uh, being corrected. And uh, theoretically, you should go through everything, help them out. Um, and this is a great way to, to improve your your Japanese. Uh, you can you know you can see what was wrong. You can see how it was corrected, um, and you know people are volunteering to to help you out, which is absolutely wonderful. I think. Um, so let's see. I think. Yeah, so it's it's really easy to make friends. Like I said, like I said, there's a huge Japanese population. Um, they need more English speakers, actually. And then uh, there's there's also a feature called reviews, where you review products in the language you're learning, and then people correct it. Uh, there's language matching, and then there's just the whole social aspect, which is is really good. Um, and there are other websites that are kind of like this. Uh, I forgot what they are, but you guys are probably gonna write it on the left side. Um, <laughs> the social, yeah. And so, um, but the reason that this site is better than all the others is because they have a huge Japanese population. Um, not the prettiest site in the world, but uh, it, it does its job and it does it really well. So, <laughs> yeah, there you go. And so that's my top 10 here. Um, Q&A time. So, but what I want to do really quick here is uh, I want to do a poll, so we're going to jump to the poll page. Gonna change for everyone. Oh, and yeah, got in. Well done. Um, and so I'm gonna open this poll. And so you can see the poll there on the right side. I'd like to see. Uh, I just kind of want to know what what your favorite was, what you thought is the best. Um, so I can kind of get a better idea of what people are are looking for, I guess, uh, for my own. Uh, my own selfish needs. <laughs> and then what we're going to do after this, we're actually going to do a, a Q&A session here with uh, the, the, the Tofu writers here. If you want to ask any questions, we can uh, we can pretend to answer them, at least. <laughs> um, so yeah, go ahead and keep your votes coming. <laughs> 